I'm here today at the McGlade Gallery at the Australian Catholic University, where the winners of the 2021 Clancy Prize will soon be announced. The annual Clancy Prize is open to all secondary Catholic schools across the Archdiocese of Sydney and awards prizes for religious artwork within a range of categories. This year, the theme of the exhibition is celebrating 200 years of Catholic education in Australia. The Catholic Church has a long and distinguished history in the promotion and creation of religious art. It's impossible to walk through some of the most famous and extraordinary art galleries in the world without encountering deep faith as expressed through art in the Catholic tradition. Whether early Christian and Byzantine, Romanesque, Gothic, Renaissance, Baroque and beyond, the Catholic Church has seen art as a way to connect humans with the divine. Artists, both famous and unknown, have been the transmitters of faith through their work. And it's amazing to think that centuries after their creation, artworks can speak to successive generations with such clarity and precision. So it's a genuine privilege to be here to view the artworks of our many talented artists from across the Archdiocese of Sydney, and to see in both them and their artworks the unbroken chain of creativity, hard work and faith that have made them finalists for the Clancy Prize in 2021. I congratulate all those who've entered the Clancy Prize and the finalists and the winners. Their beautiful and inspiring artworks help us to see that we are born in the image and likeness of God and that the creation of religious art can be a visual prayer passed down through the ages. God bless.